In this video, we will discuss how to write complete thesis in LaTeX. I will provide this template as well as all the required files for this write-up. So let's start from here. That for the thesis, we will have to select the document class as a book. And then some options are here, like we will select A4 paper, the 12-point font size, sort and compressed is used for sorting out the references and compressing them if they are more than two. One side means that the thesis will be printed on one side. So the very first package that we use here is geometry package. It is used for setting the geometry of the page like the page layout. Graphics is used for inserting figures. The input encoding package, this is used for different sorts of text and symbols and especially required when we do copy paste from MS Word. These three packages, the MS Math, MS Fonts, MS Symbols and the Gensim, they are actually for different mathematical symbols and fonts here. Another package that we will require in the thesis write-up is the NetBib, which we will use for the referencing. And in the option, the numbers uh, is to be written because it will then give a right sequence to those references or citations. We will use the hyperrep package in order to give link to different labelings as well as citations. The file contents package is used because we will attach the references file with this document. The array package is used for array as well as inside the table. The reach 2 e package is used for the justifying text and Multi-row is used in tabular environment for multi-rows inside the table. Similarly, the D column package is also used for the set purpose in tabular environment. The text companion, it is also required for different sorts of text. The books tab actually enhances the tabular environment. The indent first package is used for indenting the very first uh, sentence of a paragraph while the set space is used for setting the space of the text. For example, we can use one half spacing, double spacing. This package which is the name ref package is also used for citing some labels. And here we will set our counter, which is the section number depth to 4. So it will count up to 4 subsections in our document. And we will have to include this in the table of contents as well. The nomenclature package is used for creating the list of abbreviations or nomenclature. So we will use this package as well. The references we will have by default it will give the name is bibliography which we will change with this command to references. For the nomenclature we will have to write make nomenclature and then when it will write nomenclature we will have to change it with a renew command to the list of abbreviations and all this remaining is actually the required setup for the creating the nomenclature so we will have to copy paste this as it is and then this will be the last thing that make it other we will begin our document from the begin document till the end document so all our document will be and here so this is the begin document and here we are having the end document now here let's start with the title page so the very first thing that we will have some title pages in our thesis 
the title page begin title page and then we are having here end title page so here we can design as many pages as we want the page numbering is normally in the title pages is roman so we will have to keep these roman pages as we see here the very first thing we will have to write the title so the title is here and i have used the large font size for it and the bold face series so here i will write my title and then is it will be centered so i have begin center and i just end this one i will give it's a vertical space and i will define this how many inches i want to give it and then i will have to bring this logo and the logo is with the begin figure and end figure so here the name of the file will be changed only the rest we can keep the same the name of the scholar and the degree the scholar is going for and this is the command we will have to use we fill so that all the vertical space will be felt now it is to be noted that for each of these things in the latic tutorial series we are having different videos for all of these things so for details those videos can be consulted the we fill command will actually make this last sentence to the lowest possible space here is defined over there in the geometry package that we are having the a4 paper and one inch are the default setting on top bottom left and right these are the one of the title pages that we can design so begin center and end center and then we can go to the new page here i will give a new page and i will start with this write up and it is done over here and then the space is defined and all these things so we can change them according to our need and again a we fill and then at the end this will be here now the we fill command is necessary because we cannot adjust this one by just giving it space and inches then we go to the third title page and so on all the title pages can be covered this way and we are having now the end title page so if other title pages are required to be inserted then those title pages can be inserted here by giving enter here a new page and then another title page will be included now here we will print the nomenclature so the very first thing that it will do will print the nomenclature now the nomenclature with the renew command i have changed to the list of abbreviations and the three centimeter option will actually keep three centimeter spacing here then i will go to a new page and on the new page i will call it to make a table of contents so the new page will start in till this moment we are having the roman numbering so table of contents will start here and this is the table of contents then on the new page i will write the list of figures so here the list of figures will come here and then a new page and list of tables so on a new page and list of table will come here then i will go to a new page and this will not be a new page but it will just start the numbering with the arabic numberings so it will start after this is 123 as we see here one is coming in here now i start with my chapters now the very first chapter i want to put acknowledgement here now as we know acknowledgement chapter is not numbered so that's why i have put steric here and when steric is placed here then it will not be numbering it is like chapter 1 2 3 but it will keep rest of the formatting is like a chapter then acknowledgement is to be written here the double enter here and then name of the scholar 
we will move to another chapter and this chapter is also not to be numbered so it is abstract and the abstract will come here now automatically it will come on a new page because it's a new chapter so uh, new page writing is not necessary here and we will write our abstract here now in this abstract i am just telling how to define in this chapter i am telling about how to define abbreviations so for example this abbreviation comes as scanning electron microscope then it is defined as scm then i will write slash nomenclature and then in curly brackets scm and then in the next curly bracket the same thing here and this portion from nomenclature to here this will not come in the printout but it will only be just defined as so everywhere when i define abbreviation i will have to write this with it and then it will the printout will be like this that it will just define like this and this and it will move this to the list of abbreviations which we have defined here so the two abbreviations are already written here now for details of abbreviation one can consult the video in this comprehensive series now the introduction the introduction i have written now it is a chapter an introduction and i label this chapter so ch for the chapter and this chap 1 i have labeled it the labeling is very much required in the thesis write up because in 100 or 200 pages thesis it is very hard to maintain the numbering so the lartic will do the numbering for us